I did a little bit of a meditation and I was thinking, I was thinking about what kind of video to make. Now I've wanted to make this video. This video is being interrupted by a bloody plane right now. There you go. I've been wanting to make this video and I was doing a meditation and I was doubting myself and I was, I was second guessing myself and thinking what if I do a video about motivational, about motivation, trying to motivate others. And what if, what if I come off as an idiot? What if I, what if I make myself look stupid? Um, and I was doing this meditation and I was second guessing myself and I came to the conclusion that if I don't make this video and I don't post this video, then not only am I doing a disservice to myself by not pursuing what truly makes me happy, but at the same time, I'm not giving the message I'm trying to spread to other people a chance to get out there. Even if it's one person that takes a little bit from it, that's better than no people at all. So during this meditation that I just did, I, I realized that I am ready to do this. Um, and there's no point in having fear and judgment of others because that's what I have to do. I have to put myself out there. I have to put myself out there and do something that makes me a little bit uncomfortable in order to pursue what I'm doing, not pursue what I'm doing in order to move forward. I have to, I have to experience some uncomfort in order to move forward because that potentially could create a new outcome. Someone could watch that video. Someone new could come into my life to mentor me. Who knows the possibilities? The possibilities are truly endless. So I'm, I'm gonna do it right now. And I'm, I'm very actually, I, I have goosebumps. Like I have goosebumps thinking about it. Like, I don't know if you can, yeah. So I just, I guess here we go. So what, what I wanna say is you don't have to always vocalize what you're, what you're going through. You don't always have to vocalize your problems and your issues and everything that's happening in your life. And the reason I say that is because if you're constantly vocalizing all of those issues and problems and you're not taking any action to use those problems as, as, as a foundation essentially in your life to move you forward, to propel you forward, then you might as well keep it to yourself because you're just, you're just spitting out stupid, negative energy all the time and you're not taking action. If you're complaining nonstop about why you are unhappy in your life, why you can't do this, why you can't do that, then stop doing it. Do yourself a favor, keep your mouth shut if you're not gonna do anything about it. Now, if you are gonna do something about it, then absolutely start vocalizing it and hold yourself accountable to it. Because now you have your, you're have you giving yourself a reason to, to prove other people wrong by starting with yourself, by showing other people that your actions speak louder than words. And it's, it's it will pay off, and I'm saying this because when I first started doing YouTube and vlogging and social media stuff, it was very difficult and it made me extremely uncomfortable doing it. And now, yes, I only have 100 subscribers or 102 subscribers on my YouTube channel, but to me, that is a success. And the reason is because I got to a point in my life where I hit such an ultimate low and I decided that's that's what it was. Now, I'm not saying you have to hit an ultimate low in order to change. What I'm trying to get at is, for me, I hit an ultimate low and I knew, at that point, I realized I never wanted to go back and experience that and I knew what I had to do in order to to move forward, to propel my my life into into a into an area that I felt good and happy in. So I, I worked my ass off to get what I wanted and to get to where I am today. And now, of course, I am faced with new hurdles, new obstacles in my life, new problems in my life. But here's the thing, here's the situation. Every problem has a, has a solution. You can continue to keep that as a problem or you can use that problem and create a solution in order to propel yourself forward. People are coming, hold on a second. Hi. Hey, how are you? Hi. Hi. <laughs> oh, that's adorable. Um, where was I? Yes. Yeah, so if you have, if you're finding yourself 
with a problem, create that solution to fix the problem. Because every problem will have an equal solution for it. You just need to find it and you need to, you need to conquer that. And it's gonna be it's gonna be difficult at times to find the solution. But if you really truly listen to yourself and you follow that instinct, that gut feeling, you know that you're going to be moving in the right direction. It's it's very, very easy to get off the beaten path when you start experiencing more negative you, you start to experience more negative uh, circumstances in your life or what you may perceive as a negative in your life and let's be honest it's it's very easy to associate with negative than it is with positive because we see we're exposed to negative almost every single day look what's going on in the news all we're hearing about is this COVID-19 all this 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 the bad all the bad but we're not hearing about all of the all of the people that are living their lives normally that have it or had it um, you know and that that aren't affected by it whatsoever now I'm using that as a very very <laughs> loose example but there's um, there's so much negative that you can associate yourself with and there's so much so many reasons why you can convince yourself that it's not something is whatever it's not something you need to pursue because you're validating all of the failures that we've already experienced through life and then you're just giving yourself another reason to fail so you no longer decide to pursue or move forward and this is uh this is for me at least this is something that i've been working on a lot is throughout throughout this whole um throughout this whole time uh that i've been working on is recognizing that all of these uncomfortable situations that I, I find myself in so for example making this video right now and you know talking about uh, talking about what I'm talking about because um, yeah it does make me slightly uncomfortable because I was thinking to myself well if I make this video what if people judge me what if this that the other so on and so forth and then I ended up realizing that if I don't make this video that I'm potentially not giving this message to help someone else move forward to help someone else you know find that motivation to keep pursuing what truly makes them happy it's it's very very easy to to let failure stop you the fear of failure is a thing it really is many many motivational speakers entrepreneurs have talked about this it it, it really is a thing fear of failure absolutely is a thing it's very unlikely see here's the thing now I'm finding myself right now someone's right here getting in their car with the dogs and it's very this is what I'm talking about the fear of failure I'm freezing right now because it's almost like a perception that I'm creating in my own head of how a person's gonna perceive me by doing this and let's be honest it doesn't even matter so it, yes it happens to everybody absolutely so it happens it happens to everybody the fear of failure um, that doubt and I just had a little bit of it but now I'm getting back into it because there's no reason to have that doubt if it truly makes you happy and of course this makes me happy He's, this person's still standing there watching me talk right now and for a split second it made me hesitate there as you just saw but you know what it doesn't matter because I'm doing this to make me happy. This person doesn't know who I am. This person doesn't know what I'm doing and why I'm doing it. I have no reason to make that person happy. All I, who, the only person I have to make happy is myself. So why should I allow another person to, to potentially stop what's allowing me to pursue my happiness, to, to move forward? There's, there's the, the, the fear of failure is an extremely powerful thing and it is it is it can be overcome it really can be overcome but you have to recognize why you are overcoming it at least this is why i'm saying this because this is for me i can relate to this very easily but i recognize the fact that i'm overcoming that when that guy was there because for it, it hit me knowing that i don't need i don't need his validation to do what makes me happy i don't need his judgment if he thinks i'm an idiot talking into a camera that's completely okay because he doesn't know who I am. He doesn't know why I'm doing this. He doesn't understand that I'm doing this because this is what makes me happy. This is the career path that I want to go on. I want to I want to be able to to be a Tony Robbins, to be a Gary Vee, to 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 speak to thousands of people, to motivate them, inspire them, to be that entrepreneur, that success story, to 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 show people it is truly possible to accomplish your dreams. You just need to stay you just need to you, you just need to stay on path don't go off the beaten path keep moving forward don't be the sheep in the herd that follows where all the other ones are going 
be be the one that's leading the pack or be the one that's leading the sheep to where you want them to go be that one in a million colonel sanders was 65 years old when i believe he started kfc and at the time he was solely reliant on his social security checks and he was driving around the country trying to find potential prospects that would sign in to be part of a franchisee 65 years old and he kept pushing forward and he kept persevering and now look what look what he's look at this empire he's created so it, it goes to show you you can absolutely get what you want you just need to put in that little bit of work and stay on path be the one in the million be the one person that stays up later than everybody else be the one person that keeps going through all these hurdles in life these hard times and and keep standing up there's a saying you fall six times you stand up seven be that person that keeps standing up be the one in the million be the one success in the million be the reason why other people can become successful why other people can pursue their passion if you got anything from this video today thanks a lot for watching really appreciate it hopefully you guys subscribe to the channel give it a thumbs up leave a comment below with what's going on or what what you're pursuing currently in your life really hope that somebody got a got something from this message we got another plane <laughs> there you go plane um, if you got anything from this video like I was saying subscribe to the channel leave a thumbs up if that's what you're about really appreciate it the goal is to make this into a travel vlog travel spread the word help entrepreneurs help other people become successful and you know show and give people reason that they can succeed let's be let's be honest here everyone wants to succeed other people want to see other people succeed as well so for me the hundred subscribers I have on YouTube and the I think it's and 10,000 on TikTok, you know, they want to see me succeed. That's why they keep tuning in. Be the reason for them to see you succeed so then they can also have that drive to succeed. Thanks again for tuning in, guys. Feel good. Feel, I feel really good. That, that made me really uncomfortable doing this. Um, but you know what? It's just another, it's just another another chapter in my life now I'm really excited to see what happens next what other opportunities present themselves even to see where these you know to see where these vlogging videos or these one-off uh, motivational videos come in to see where the confidence comes out and how I can vocalize my thought process more clearly and give more people that drive to as well to just you know to give people that drive so they can they can give themselves the reason to keep moving forward good check this out Bruh.